Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's Aging BJD. Please excuse me if I sound a little off. I am laying down. I was feeling a bit under the weather. And uh, so I was browsing and of course I bumped into this. I've been on the lookout for silk stones. Um, the Dia de los Muertos doll sold out. And so I'm just online browsing and looking for shit. This doll is cute. She's got some fun pieces on her. The pants are really nice. The jacket is spectacular. The top is not my favorite. And the faux bling is not my favorite. The purse is phenomenal. I love me a gold purse. But how is your purse more golder than your actual bracelets? And your earrings. It doesn't make any sense why they went that route. Or your ring. Um, also, the shirt seems like it's an, a really nice material, but the cut of the shirt is just not it for me. I'm not super, um, how do I explain it? I'm not, I'm not running for this. I'm not going to run and get this. $35 is fair. And I say that because just a jacket alone is $35. Somebody's going to want probably $85 for that jacket. The pants are really nice. The pants are really what's giving. That shirt is weak as fuck. The purse is nice also, and the shoes are just black standard shoes. So I think that this $35 price point is kind of fair. But I also want to be extreme and say that maybe even a $30 price point would have been a little better because of Mattel Creations shipping cost, which brings your order closer to $10 just in shipping. So yeah, I don't know. Um, her box is... Her box is all right. It's got the lady back there. For some reason with my iPhone, I find that the picture looks better if you just swipe in with your finger as opposed to clicking in. Maybe when you click in, it's because you're using the app's program to open it. But yeah, it's, the doll's not, I'm not losing my mind. I don't know. If this doll sold out, I wouldn't be surprised. But... It's not going to be bought by me.